Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome to a Dollar Tree and Wine. Yes, I haven't done one of these Dollar Tree and Wines in such a long time or even a Dollar Tree haul. Yeah, Dollar Tree kind of escaped me for a little bit but I am back and I have a pretty decent size haul to share with you. It's from a different couple of trips to the Dollar Tree, it's not just one. <laughs> Uh, so I hope this video finds you on a day that you're just cozy, you want to relax with a glass of wine. Uh, today is Friday and it's been raining all day and it's still raining. And if you hear some drops, that is the rain hitting the tin roof that is from my old grooming shop. Yes, I moved my craft room upstairs to my old grooming shop. So I do have a craft room tour update for you in the near future. So let's have a drink of our wine and let's get into this haul, shall we? So cheers to all of you. And I'm pretty excited about this haul. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. So I actually came to cross these today, which is Friday, the 18th, I believe. Uh, and I came across these, oh my goodness, let me put my wine off to the side a little bit. Okay, so if you've seen a few videos back, I'm actually getting into journals and I'm decorating journals, but oh my goodness, these are little journals. Look, oh my goodness. And there's two different notepads in here and oh my goodness this is such a good deal especially if you're wanting to get into journaling um, or a junk journal um, anything really so I got two of this style of the pretty flowers and then I got two of the pink style. Now there was one other style, it was like little circles, like different color circles, but I didn't really care for that one. Um, I really liked these journals, or these colors, I should say. So yeah, and they're both the same. Have the two inside of it. Oh, it's, I might even go back and even get more of these so I'm just all set to just journal my heart out <laughs> okay then I was looking around and I went into like their mailers and I came across this which really intrigued me um, flexible mailer mailers uh, envelopes and it's three pieces what really intrigued me was two time reusable I'm like what and if you look, I think you can reuse this two times. So if you send this to someone, they can actually open it up and reuse it themselves. That's what I'm getting at. So let's go ahead and open this up because I'm just really intrigued. But I don't know how someone can reuse this because, you know, you're going to write on the bag the address. And it's a pretty decent little size. Oh, yes it is. Yes it is. So, you close it up. So you would probably seal it up on this one first. Yes. You would seal it up on this one. They would take it off. And they can reuse it if they want. But my question is, if you're writing on the front, how can they reuse it? Unless they put a piece of paper or something over it, maybe. But I thought that was really nifty. That's a pretty cool idea. Um, this is a 10 by 13 size. And yeah, so, and there's three of them. So that's why I got it, was because there's three, three mailers in here. Um, yeah, three mailers. And when I got home and I was taking out everything, I noticed the two time. And I'm like, what? So, I got two of those. Okay.
Okay, so I got some more of these craft clamps. Um, I love these and I have some and I don't know where they're at because <laughs> I use them all the time and they just go in different places. So I picked up another, another package of those. Then I came across this craft scraper and I was intrigued by this as well. And I get, you know, when I'm crafting, I do get a lot of hot glue on my table. And so, and I do use something to scrape it off. So I'm like, this would be pretty cool if it's what I think it is. Huh. Oh, maybe it's just, it goes like this. I thought this opens and there was a blade in there. Okay, so if you receive this, it's empty, it's hollow. I don't even know why it comes apart. But this is pretty, see how flat it is? This is pretty sharp, so maybe you can just scrape it along and get all the hot glue. I might show this later on in the video just to use it and show you how it, how it goes. So, yeah, and that was new. I've never seen this before. Okay, then I seen these, and I haven't seen them yet, and I was like, these are pretty cool, galvanized letters. That is so cool, galvanized letters, so I picked up three of them for different crafts. Okay, and I needed some more of these dots, um, the Velcro ones. I ran out of them, and I needed some more, so I picked up two more of these and these are so useful for everything so and I finally came across the roller cutter I've been on the hunt for these I have searched every single Dollar Tree in my area and finally they finally showed up so I picked up two of them and when I go back I'm probably going to pick up a couple more just to have in my stash so, really excited about that. Okay, then I went into the beauty area, um, you know, with all the makeup and whatnots, and I seen this facial ice roller, but I thought this would be really cool to use in crafting for when you glue stuff down, and you can just take it, oh yeah take it and use this so instead of using like a bone folder you just use this to put the glue down oh yeah that's gonna work really well so I picked up one of these and again it's an ice a facial ice roller and I just seen it in this color otherwise I would have picked up pink since my craft room has a pink theme so pretty cool and then also in the makeup area, I seen these and thought these were really nifty and cute. Um, they're called beauty jars, but I thought these would be really cool to, to grab and have in my stash because I can put like sequence mixes in here and for Happy Meal for, oh yeah, that's really cool. So there's a little seal that's in the top there. So you can put your sequence mix in there. Put the little top on right here. So nothing pops out when they open it. Oh, that's so cool. So yeah, definitely this is a cool idea. Um, I seen three and I picked up three. Hopefully they'll get more because I'll just keep on picking them up as I go. And I just love the colors the pink and the teal color okay then I picked up some of this everlasting lush glue or lush lash glue um, and it's 100% vegan so that's pretty cool my daughter loves to wear eyelashes and I get them from Dollar Tree and it's from the same brand and I seen the glue and I haven't seen it before so I picked her up one so when she uses it I'm gonna ask her for a review and I'll let you know in the next Dollar Tree haul all right 
I kind of went sticker crazy. <laughs> yes, and again, this is not all in one trip. This is from three separate Dollar Tree hauls um, trips. So let's go ahead and get into these stickers. And I am so in love with these. Let's take a sip of our wine before we get into the stickers. Ah, all right. So the first set of stickers that I picked up was these really pretty dots. Um, very super pretty. I just seen it in this color. I'm wondering if there's other colors. If there is, I'll pick those up as well. But I like the shininess of them. Look how pretty that is. So I picked up some of those. Actually, I'm going to put them off to the side because my cam... I have a new camera, by the way. Thank you, Dad. If you're watching this video. <laughs> um, my dad bought me a really nice vlogging camera. So if you see a difference in the quality of the videos, that's why. And my, I noticed in the last video, because that's the first video I posted with this camera, the, the audio is so much crisp and clear. Oh, yes. Thank you, Dad, so much. So, all right, let's continue. So, I picked up some of these stickers. And I bought three of these. And these are just so cute. The butterfly and the gold. So pretty. So I picked up three of those. And then I see these flowers. And there were so many different types. And they're a little puffy. A little puffy. But oh, look how beautiful those are. So I picked up... I think I only picked up one of each. Because I was trying not to, you know break my my bank you know <laughs> so I picked up one of those picked up one of these and one of this color they are so pretty and I actually picked up two of this one so picked up two of those Oh, and I got another one of these, so picked up two. And then this last one. I had to pick up three sunflowers. I love sunflowers. I'm actually going to have a big sunflower patch. Um, I'll be posting my uh, garden channel below. I'm also going to be doing a... Um, a haul for gardening so if you like gardening make sure you go over there and check that out on my garden channel I will link it below in the description but oh my goodness so excited for those and they're so pretty then I seen these and thought these were gorgeous and have that you know boho look to them only seen this one. I uh, wish they had a couple of them, but picked up one of those. And of course, spring is around the corner, so I picked up a spring sticker pack. There was only one, so I only picked up this. And then I came across this really pretty one. Uh, you can't beat this. A dollar, well now it's a dollar twenty-five. Dollar twenty-five? Like you can't beat this. It's so pretty. I thought I had a couple of these, but I guess I just picked up one. Then I seen this one. So with the unicorn, sparkle, rainbow. And I just love the pastel look to it. I'm really getting into pastels lately. So I had to pick up one of those. And I grabbed two of those, so I have two. Then I thought this was really neat. It's a, um, a travel one, Make Memories. I love the luggage, the tickets, 
Oh, I just love it all. Little pictures. Yeah. So, grabbed one of those. Then, again, kind of with like the spring theme, um, picked up two of these and they're a 3D look. So that's pretty cool. And I just love the happy and lucky. And then they had one for summer. Picked up two of those. Again, 3D. And then here is another travel one, which is pretty neat. Just love it. And it's a 3D one as well. And they had a summer one. So I had to pick up that. And I love the bikini. <laughs> Look how cute that is. All right. Then I debated on getting this one or not. And I'm like, no, I'm going to get it. Summer. More summer stickers. And in my craft room tour, I have finally set up my little um organize organization of how i set up my stickers i can't wait to show you that okay so then i found these i thought these were really pretty has some birds and some butterflies and i found one more that was kind of like it there was actually another one but i didn't really care for it Again, with the birds and the butterflies. thought these were really elegant and pretty. And then I came across some really gorgeous butterflies. So, found these really pretty butterflies. I love the colors. But the butterflies that I'm really excited on are these butterflies. Oh my goodness, these are so gorgeous. I got three of this kind of butterfly. So those are just so pretty. Love the gold foil. And then I got two of this kind of butterfly. And then two of this one. And I may go back and get some more of these. And here is the last butterfly. I got three of these. So pretty. Love the purple colors in them. Gorgeous. Then I came across these. Oh my goodness, these are so gorgeous. I believe this is one sticker, and then this is one sticker, and then this is one sticker. But I got, let's see, two of these windows. Two of these. And I believe this is a one that comes apart. Or you can just take this whole thing and use it on um, a project. So pretty. And I love this one. I bought three of these. Again, if they have more, I'm going to get more of each kind. Gorgeous. And the last one is this one i bought two and that is it for the stickers i got into some yarn so this is a really pretty color i got this to do some pom-poms so i got this color this color this one a pretty yellow a pretty pink and a pretty purple and they kind of look like pastel color then I came across these cupcake liners 
Will you be quiet? I love this color. So I got three of the big ones. I used the cupcake liners to make rosettes. Absolutely love using cupcake liners. And then I found the little mini versions. So, and I will try to pick up more of those as well. We're gonna get into some peeps. Yes, the peeps. All right, so I seen these lollipop ring peeps. There's four to them. And I got this. I'll show you in a minute. So I got the, the lollipop peeps. And I found a lip balm. And there's different flavors. A whole bunch of different flavors. There was grape, cherry, uh, strawberry. A whole bunch of different ones. But I picked a vanilla one. And then... I found these peeps. They had a whole bunch of different flavors on the marshmallow peeps. I got the coffee flavor because I found this peep treat bags. Okay, so I found the peep treat bags because I'm going to put a little baggie together with this one of the lollipop rings and a lip balm. And one of these really cute paint sheets for one of my crafty friends for Easter. So I thought that would be a really cool idea. Okay, this I thought was really neat. Um, stainless steel drinking straws. Very good idea. And then it has the, the little brush that comes with it so you can clean the straws e eco-friendly reusable I love it then I got a few Easter items got some of these eggs different sizes I'm gonna be doing some decorating out in front of my house with one of my planters that looks like a red truck and I do different themes for the holidays so I'm gonna do an Easter theme then I seen these and I thought these were really cool. Some Easter eggs that are like Legos. <laughs> oh, you know what? That is really cool. Let's, I think these will stack. Let's try it. Let's try it. They might stack. I wasn't expecting the holes on the bag. Oh my goodness, they do. So they do stack. So if you have a little kid that loves Legos, there you go. You can put like different different Lego characters for um, an Easter basket. There's a really cute idea. I got it for Happy Mail. <laughs> Then I found these really cute spatulas, um, little Easter bunny, and this one says Cottontail Farms, carrots, chocolates, and eggs. Um, there was different colors on these. Got this for, you know, hot glue so you don't burn your fingers. And they're little. Okay, back into like the hair accessories. And I so happened to come across these in, on an end cap, like on a side on the end cap. And when I seen these, the first thing I thought of was some tassels. Yes, put some jump rings and put some beads hanging down. Oh, I thought of tassels right away. So I got the angel wings. And I got these really cute um, teardrop ones. And then just a plain, oh no, it's little stars. These little stars. And then I really like the angel wing, so I bought two of those. And again, I might be going back and getting more of those, because those are really cool. And then in the, in the same little section were these 
ponytail hooks. And when I see these, I thought of journals. Wrap it around a journal. There you go. And this, um, these were the two that they had, the different colors. And as you see, there's only two hooks and then some hair ties in the middle. And I'm always needing hair ties with my crazy thick hair. So no problem. Very good find. Okay. And, um, nope, this is not the last Easter thing, but I found this really cute Hello Spring pink truck with the little bunny butts with the feet hanging out. Oh, and again, I'm going to be putting this on my red truck pot and that will look so cute with the eggs. Then I grabbed some of these, some file holders. Um, I like to use this to organize my pocket letters. And of course I had to pick up pink and I grabbed two of those. Okay, so in the crafter square section, I came across this puzzle saver, a laminator. Laminate and preserve. But you know what, It's you can use this on pretty much anything. So I'm gonna try this on a different types of projects and see if this will work even better than Mod, Mod Podge. Um, it has a little spatula. So I will keep you updated on this. And then right beside it was some craft glue. I'm always looking for different types of craft glue. So I picked up one of those to try. Okay, so my bathroom, um, I decorate uh, my bathroom for the different seasons and right now I have a spring theme which is birds and bird houses and whatnot and I came across these really cute little bird houses so I'm gonna go ahead and paint them up and put them in my bathroom to go with my other type of bird houses because I have a I have a larger size bird house that I got from Target uh, dollar spot that's sitting on a shelf and I have little shelves on the wall and I thought these would be really cute stacked on those shelves because I have little ceramic little birds um, from the Target dollar spot. So I thought these would be really cute to add to that decor. All right, and then I found some paint brushes, this brush set. It looks to be a very good brush set. So hopefully the bristles won't fall out. But I think I got a couple of these before. They worked really good. So I grabbed a pack of that. And then I came across this. Um, the Artist uh, palette. You can make different colors of paints. Thought that was pretty nifty. For all my paints. Then I went organized crazy. I got some more of these storage cases for like, you know, um, embellishment boxes. Got, or for just organizing really. So I got two of these. Two of these. And all the, the both these and the last ones I just showed you are in the hardware section. And today I found these, which these were in the Easter section, like the Easter uh, presents. So I'm like, okay, yeah, so that's a pretty good organization bin. So I picked up three of those. And then back in the Crafter Square, I found these bamboo rings, which made me think of one of these. I forgot what you call this, but you alter it. So I picked up two of these so I can do something like that. The only difference is it doesn't have this top here. And it's wood, so maybe it will stick better. I got 
two more items and then we're done. I picked up, I can't say it really loud, some of these for my kids Easter basket. I'm not going to say what it is because my daughter's right outside the door cleaning her room. <laughs> so picked up two of those and my very last item are these candles which is the same scent and this smells so good so I can't wait to light this and you can also friend this you can uh, send this as a gift to someone it has a to and from so I thought that was pretty cool too there was other scents but this one was the best um, that I feel uh, was the best smelling one all right friends oh well, thank you so much for sticking around and watching my Dollar Tree haul I can't wait to see you in the next video and until then take care Bye.